Hey guys, this is Hardiki Devre and I have a good news for you all GitHub users. You might have seen or got to know from the title itself that GitHub free users now get unlimited private repositories. Before this announcement was made, GitHub had offered free accounts but at the cost that you need to pay for the private repositories that you create. If you guys want a private repository and you are a free user, you need to purchase a pro plan for it. This was the previous thing, but now you guys can make unlimited private repository even if you are a free user. This is really cool, right? GitHub is an awesome development platform because of its awesome features. One of these is that it supports third-party API. There are many other changes that are done in the pricing policies of the GitHub packages. In addition to this, GitHub has also changed the name of GitHub Developer Suite to GitHub Pro in order to help developers better understand the tools that they need. Now, the question comes up, why you should go for a paid version while GitHub is now providing free version at the same thing? In the paid version, you get unlimited private repository, unlimited public repository. Along with that, you can have unlimited collaborators working on that private repositories. Here the difference comes up in the paid version and the free version. In the free version, you get unlimited private repository, unlimited public repository, but the condition here is that on the private repository, you can just have maximum of three collaborators. So this is not going to be useful for large enterprises who work with large number of collaborators. This feature of private repository was already available in GitLab. Let me know in the comment section what were your views about this good news. Now, let me show you guys the practical session for this. So, when you go to github.com and you want to make a new repository, so you click on new repository option. Type in the required repository name. For now, I am typing Hardiki. And now, you guys can see that we have two options. One is public and the other is private. Firstly, we used to have only public repository options available. When we need to click on private, we had to pay for it. But now, as you can see, it is for free. Now, let me show you guys the issue that we have here. That is, of the collaborators. My account is a private one. So, when I click on the settings and then I click on the collaborators option, you can see here that there are max of three collaborators which can work on this repository. If you want to see the pricings, you can visit github.com slash pricing. So this was a new update. Hope it was useful for you guys. Let me know in the comment section your views on this news. Also subscribe to my channel for more such amazing videos.